Hi guys, it's Lauren Gottlieb. It is my birthday celebration and you're watching me on Follow. Um, very first thing that comes to my mind when I hear a birthday is probably a lot of panic. There's a lot to organize. You have to get all your friends together. Most of them are working. Most of them have all these other things going on. Um, but uh, I don't know. This year, I just decided I wanted to do something so different because I've had three of my favorite birthdays ever in my life here in India. Uh, first year, uh, they celebrated for me on Chalak for my very first episode. Okay. And uh, for the next two years, I just had these big, huge parties where all my friends came. And uh, last year, Rithik Russian uh, came forward with a cake at Aifa, and everyone split sides, and he was walking forward and saying me happy birthday. I'm like, you can't top it. Like, I've done, I've had the best birthdays. So this year, I just didn't feel like having another party. I didn't feel like traveling. I didn't feel like doing any of it. So uh, instantly this idea came to me to do something different, to do something for other people. Mm -hmm. And so this idea came and then all of a sudden the name came and the whole concept. So what I'm starting is called Leap for Hunger. Uh, I'm going to teach a free dance class for 400 people. Now, everybody loves the word free. Right. <laughs> it doesn't matter where you are in the world, the word free works. But. Uh, What's going to happen is, is that everyone's going to come and it'll help just spread awareness, but instantly they'll realize that it's so much more than just a dance class, that they're there for other people. So uh, during that time, my team is going to be making these snack packs with like a juice box, water, uh, a burger, cookies, crackers, fruits, everything will be inside. And afterwards, hopefully 500 to 1,000 lunches are made and we're going all over to Mumbai, to all the NGOs, all the orphanages, all the slums, and we're handing them out to people. So uh, I'm really excited for that. So this started as just an event, just something I wanted to do for my birthday. And then all of a sudden, you know, people are messaging me from Chennai, from uh, Delhi, from Dubai. Everyone wants to get involved. And um, I think a lot of people want to do things like this. You know, we worry all day about our lives, mm -hmm. our hair, makeup, wardrobe, our boyfriends, girlfriends, our jobs. Everything is always me, me, me. That it's a nice outlet and a nice thing to do for everybody every now and then is just to forget about yourself and to do something just for someone else. So along with um, sharing lunches and feeding people, it's really like a social experiment, like a social initiative where we're all together going to go and we're sharing smiles, we're sharing hugs, we're sharing love with people. Um, so I don't know. I, I don't know how it's going to turn out tomorrow. We'll see if it's something that continues for forever and ever. That would be so great. Uh, nothing. Oh, nothing. I, I've traveled so much lately. I've had such a great uh, year this last year. I didn't want anything for myself. So nothing. I don't even know if afterwards if I'm going to party. This is my birthday party. Awesome. So I honestly, I couldn't think about celebrating my birthday in any other way or place than I'm doing it right now. Um, this is it. Like this is the best idea I could ever come up with to share it with 400 people, you know, that are coming to my event and then share it with even more people around town. I mean, it's kind of the ultimate. Best birthday memories, uh, last year when Rithik Russian uh, gave me a birthday cake that was huge. My first year I was very upset that I was away from my family, but everyone, all my friends came together and just made me feel so loved. Um, so that was pretty good. I don't remember too many of my birthdays from the past, like um, in the US, because these ones have been so memorable. So I think the best birthdays of my life have been in the last three years. Any other gifts, something I would like this year? I would like, I'd like to see my family. I know no one can bring that to me or give that to me, but that'd be a pretty good gift. Um, there's no plans as yet to open up a dance academy, but I think uh, more and more I'm noticing that people 
could really use it or, or would like it or want me to do it. Um, so yeah, I think I think maybe one day. Uh, Govinda, because I feel like we do some amazing dance steps together. <laughs> I mean, maybe. Um, I don't have any plans right now to do another reality show. I've actually spent 10 years in reality TV. I was a contestant on So You Think You Can Dance. I helped choreograph for a couple of years. I was an all-star for three years. I moved here. I did Chalak for three years. So I've done so much of it. So I know one day, uh, one day I may make my own. Let's see. The trailer looks so awesome. I saw it and I like tweeted them all right away and I just wanted to watch it like right now. I just thought it was too cool. So uh, that's a movie I'm really waiting to see. Any signature stuff for birthdays? Um, we should create one. But I think it would be like a, like a, like a, like if you had a streamer type of thing. I don't know, maybe something like that, or maybe like the little wobble because it just it feels good, it makes you feel happy.